In this video, we will cover the features of the Smart Usage Reporting Portal. Once you have set up your services and signed in, your portal will bring you directly to the dashboard. This page provides information on each one of your Smart Room System units, displayed with easy to understand graphics about the adoption, collaboration, and quality of your devices. The overview page can be filtered by start date, end date, region, site, and device, allowing for more detailed information to be displayed. The adoption bar chart displays the most frequently used SRS systems. You can filter the view to display the number of sessions made by units or by the number of minutes the unit has been used. The collaboration bar chart highlights the audio, video, and sharing capabilities for each SRS unit. You can update the view to display the amount of collaboration in minutes or as a percentage. You can also update the view to display the top or bottom used audio, video, or sharing units by location. The quality pie chart displays the quality of each collaboration session based on the mean opinion score, or MOS. The MOS is an industry standard that measures the quality of the session. The usage reporting portal also provides more detailed information on the reports page. The reports section can be navigated through the links on the left hand side a report can, will be generated for every link you click. The adoption section will create different reports on how well your SRS units are being implemented by location. For example, we have selected the duration by SRS site report. This report will provide information on the location, number of sessions, and duration of sessions, displayed in an easy to understand chart. The collaboration section will create different reports on how well your systems are being used. For example, we have selected the SRS modality by duration link. This report will highlight the type of service, number of sessions, and duration for all. The quality section will create a pie chart of the overall quality group by device. In this report, you can review the conferencing device name, the room, the MOS, and the modality type. Each report can be altered by start date, end date, region, site, and device by using the filter drop-down at the top of the reports page. If you ever need more details on what each report entails, a description of each one is available on the reports homepage. Once you have selected which report you would like to view, click on the link to the left. The report will automatically generate. You can review your data here or export to email in either a PDF, Word, or CSV file format. The information displayed in your portal can be altered by selecting the Setup tab at the top of the screen. Once you have reached the Setup page, you will see a list of definitions for a deeper understanding of the options available to you. To select the option you would like to view or edit, pick the corresponding link on the left-hand side. For more information on Setup options, please watch the Smart Usage Reporting and Proactive Monitoring Setup video, available on smarttech.com forward slash training for business. Once you're finished editing your settings, simply return to the dashboards page by selecting the dashboard link at the top of the screen. Or log out of your portal by selecting the gear at the top right of the page and selecting log out. To download quick reference guides or watch more training videos on usage reporting or proactive monitoring, please visit smarttech.com forward slash training for business.